Hello, welcome back to my channel. Okay, so today, this morning, it is like 8 a.m. right now. Well, now it's 9 actually. So I was on my way, I was on my way back from taking my laundry to get done. And I, you know, I'm staying in a new hotel, but I'm still the same distance away from my laundry lady. So instead of like going to the place that was closer for my laundry to be done, I was like, I'm not gonna cheat on my laundry lady because she always puts my socks together. She never loses my stuff. So I'm just gonna go to her. And then on the way back, I saw this bagel place and I was like, wow, I could really use a bagel. And I also hit Whole Foods and I got like some sandwich stuff. So we're gonna review the bagel real quick that I got because this shit was 50 15 freaking dollars, okay? So this better be the best bagel I've ever had in my life. Okay, so the place that I went to is called Liberty Bagels. I had looked it up on Yelp right before I walked in. So, I mean, it's a heavy, it's definitely very heavy. My issue is, is that for $15, I got this one bagel at Liberty Bagels, but then for $15 at Whole Foods, I got enough stuff for sandwiches for my entire week. And I know like I'm not expecting to like obviously get enough food for an entire week when I'm getting takeout, but $15, holy crap. All right, so let's open this up. I mean, it had really good reviews. And then, you know, they also have the, the much coveted rainbow bagel, which I know a lot of people like that used to be a craze. I didn't get the rainbow bagel personally because I didn't want my poop to turn green. Okay. So this thing is huge. Yeah. Mm. So I got the Novocado with cream cheese. It's the salmon bagel. Check that out. Okay, so, I mean this does look awesome. But I would expect this to be like $10, not $15. This has um, salmon, capers. Well, it has a lot of salmon though. So honestly, maybe it is worth the $15 because maybe I don't know how hard it is to get salmon here. I mean, it's packed. It's packed full of salmon. It has capers, cream cheese, avocado, onions. It has a lot of stuff. I love capers. All right, let's dig in. Wow. That's really good. Wow, and it has tomatoes. Okay, so it does taste really, really fresh, which is what I was craving. I feel like I've been eating out a lot here, and I haven't been really having like any like fresh tasting food. Not like that, I mean like healthy, because the tacos that I have are really fresh. Like so far, a lot of stuff that I've had here has been fresh, except for Atomic Wings, those wings, ugh. This bagel is really fresh and it tastes healthy, which I feel like I haven't had like any real healthy food while I've been here. That's really nice. The restaurant itself, the staff were very friendly. But what turned me off is that when I was walking in, there was like some brown stuff smeared on the door. I'm not gonna say that it was poop, but I'm not gonna say that it wasn't poop because it looked exactly like poop. As far as ease of ordering, I walked in there and they had a ton of like Uber Eats and like delivery guys there. And they were just throwing them out, getting their food, throwing it out there, getting it, throwing it out. Like they were like slamming those bagels out. And you know, I walked up, I ordered my bagel and then in two minutes, my stuff was ready. So it was really fast. The place was really clean on the inside, except for that like possible poop smudge on the outside of the door, which was really gross. The price, I think the price is super steep, but I mean, I guess that it does align with what you get because you get a lot of food. But for $15, come on, it's so good though. There's the perfect mix of like sour, sweet, and savory between the cream cheese, the salmon, and the capers, the onions, and the avocado. It's just, it is really good. I mean, YOLO, I'm only in New York once, so yeah, obviously I'll pay $15 for a bagel, but I probably wouldn't pay $15 for another bagel. <laughs> okay, so as for flavor, I would probably say five out of five, 100%. Ease of ordering, five out of five. I literally walked in, ordered it, and then they spit it right back out for me. Price, I'm gonna give it a 3.5 out of five, because what you do get is a lot. 
but the price of this is just insane. $15, and then of course I tip them, because I tip everybody, so then it came out to like $18. Cleanliness of restaurant, 3.5 out of 5, because the outside of the door had that like brown smear on it. And freshness, 5 out of 5 for sure. I'm gonna go and uh, finish this up. I've already eaten half of my half, so still got a whole nother half to go. Ooh. So, see you guys later. Thanks for watching.